Hey everybody, welcome back to Final Fantasy V. Once again, I did some uh, off-screen grinding, mostly for some... Uh, trying to find certain enemies to fill out my bestiary, which I wasn't able to find a couple of them. Supposedly, I'll only find them here, but I might have to save filling the bestiary out for an, for an off-screen playthrough of this. Um, another thing I did was learn some, uh, blue magics off-screen. Um, I went outside and learned... I went back to the, um, Library of the Ancients and learned level 5 death. That will actually be pretty useful coming up. Um, I learned Pond's Chorus from the Archeo Toads that appear here. Um... And then 1,000 Needles, which you can learn from uh, the Lamias. Um, <clears throat> Cactars, iron ironically, don't appear in this game. They don't first appear until Final Fantasy VI, but their signature attack, 1,000 Needles, makes its first appearance here. So with that done, we can uh, continue on through the Ronka Ruins. Actually, you know, okay, I have, okay, you have fine passages, what do you have, control, I don't know if I need that so much anymore, um, I'll give you fine pits, because there are some, uh, trap doors around here, which you can see if you have... if you have the Geomancer ability. Okay, you're still really bothersome with... Oops! Aw, oh, damn it! Okay, thank you. Oh, but the frickin' silence still went through. Fortunately, that should wear off after battle. potion. Yeah, I think it's this way, that, that little treasure room that you saw. Yeah, and you can see those, those holes wouldn't be visible unless I had fine pits equipped. 5,000 gil, nice. Shuriken, Power Armlet, Moonring Blade, and an Ancient Sword. So, not a bad haul. Um, let's see, can you equip the Ancient Sword? Yeah. Sometimes inflicts Age status. And it's better than what she has now. Let's see, what else did I get? There's something else that... Oh yeah, the, uh... Power armlet. Oh, really? The Spoony Bard equips the power armlet? Okay, uh... I would have expected the Knight to be able to equip the power armlet, but... Um, hmm, should I give it to... It'll boost, it'll give you a nice speed boost. The only thing that goes down is resistance. I don't know if he really needs resistance that badly.
There's 1,000 needles in action. As it usually does, it deals an automatic 1,000 damage that ignores any uh, defensive buffs. Holy crap. I guess these guys just have high evasion, which is why even my physical attackers seem to miss so much. King Shades fighting some kind of what you no did you see that viewers I saw it I walked to the side here and the freaking pit actually sucked me into it no has a chance to use White Wind on them. Gives us three AP a pop, though. So that's pretty nice. Now here we have another save point. Which we might as well take advantage of. Okay. 
Oh, there's one of the enemies I was I was trying to find. Hydras. Then there's another, he has a palette swap version called Ghidra that also appears around the same area. And only in this area. Oh, oh, he absorbs some of those crap. Man, you just love using that on Lena, don't you? Okay. Well, here we are. Hey, what's up? Father! Ugh, that be damned cap! Clapper Claw blocks the path. Papa. Silence. There's no time for chatter. That beast is the guardian of these runes. It can change its weakness at will. Make yourselves useful and defeat it. Okay. So yeah, he's one of those uh, wall change bosses. He can 
He can change his uh, elemental weaknesses and and resistances. Did we get old to stay on? That could that could really cripple him. Sap. Oh, that deals poison. blow through all of Lena's MP just yet. Because there's another phase he's gonna go into shortly. Oh, that deals quite a bit. And Blaze. That, that, that puts sap on everybody. Oh, he's starting to go nuts with it, too. So yeah, I guess either old didn't go through, or it didn't cripple him nearly as much as it seems to do to us. Gone to a phase where he absorbs thunder now. That's great. Uh, um, can we? Yeah, we can't change your equipment. doesn't even seem to give any indication when he's using his, um, his wall change ability. Ah, oh, there we go. Got him. Archives survived. Oh, look at it. Such energy. This is the true power of the crystals? Okay, so for his final phase... Oh, God. Okay, hear that. I think he's susceptible to level 5 death in this phase. Yes! Nice.
Good work. Very good. <laughs> uh, yeah, that wasn't ominous at all. Father? Papa? The Earth Crystal should be just ahead. Oop, still poisoned. Father. Papa. This is bad. Something's got to be controlling him. Bart, stop. Don't even try it. Step aside. <laughs> With the four of you gathered like this, it will be easier to destroy you all. the hell? Another... Well, this girl knows how to make an entrance. Grandpa! Grandpa, I'm so glad you're okay. Uh, still don't know who she is. Oh, he just throws the, uh, Speech bubble side. Creel, you're Creel. Yay, Gal's memory returned. Fully this time, apparently. Grandpa, I missed you so much. Father. Papa. Oh, don't worry. I just hit him with a little strike of thunder. He should be okay. Uh, where? Lena. Sarissa? Sarissa, is that you? It really is you. Sarissa. I can't believe it. You're alive. Papa. Papa. Ah, uh, the touch and reunion's gonna be cut short, it looks like. X Death's gonna be revived. And with him comes his awesome music. Some some people in the fan base don't like X Death as much as some of the other Final Fantasy villains. He seems to be a bit more generic than most. But like I said, one thing he definitely has going for him is he has one of the best late motifs. X Death. Galif, it's good to see you again. For it means I have returned. <laughs> I I can't really do his voice in uh that he has in a uh, Dissidia. He also has a really good voice there. Crystals, obey my magic. Give me your power. Smite these vermin. You think we're just gonna let you? S you think we're gonna sit back and let you do whatever you want? Uh, I guess so. Barts. <laughs> now the crystals have been destroyed. Next shall be your world, Gallif. Father. Papa. Teresa, Lena, Bartz, and you, warriors from another world. I fear your work is still unfinished. You must not allow the world to disappear into nothingness. 
Light of Earth, come forth and reclaim your essence from me. Father. Papa. Get back. The crystal must be saved. Father, hold on. You can't die. Sarissa, forgive me. I wasn't much of a father. Lena, Sarissa, please stay together. Become each other's strength. Bartz, take care of them, as I cannot. Wait, father, you can't. Don't, don't leave us. Rescue the Shard of Warrior Spirit. Samurai. Dragoon. Dancer. Chemist. No form Uh oh. What's going on? It's the runes. They're falling. Another load bearing crystal. What the hell is with all of them? We gotta get out of here. Everybody to the airship. Well, here it makes sense since it was stated the crystal was holding this thing up. Lena, come on. Thankfully, you escape automatically. None of this uh, timed, timed escape BS. Hold fast. This will be a bumpy ride. What the hell are you doing standing out on that thing? Yeah, we gotta get moving. And now. Huh? What's going on? It's all come back to me. I remember everything. X-Death is an evil warlock from my world. Thirty years ago, he came here to destroy this world's crystals. I and three others, the Dawn Warriors, sealed him with the power of the crystals. Everything was fine for thirty years. We thought it was all over. But something bad was happening to the crystals. Once we figured it out, we took the meteors and came back here. But I was too late. Exodus not only been freed, but he's returned to our world. It's because we used too much of the crystal's power, right? No. We were the ones who left X Death on this world in the first place. Back then we should have dragged him back to our world, like he said. He? So you guys are really going back. Yep. We've got to seal X death again. Creel's meteorite should have still have some juice left. Probably only enough for one more trip though. Bartz, Lena, Ferris, thank you so much for everything. I'll miss you guys. Wait, you're not taking us with? What kind of nonsense is that? We're going with you. Yeah, I mean, this would be a pretty short game if not. No, you're not. This is the last meteorite. That means that if you went to my world, you'd never be able to come back here. 
Farewell. Goodbye. Galif, Krill. anything we can do here yet. Um, do we just head back to the airship? Yep. Bards. Yeah? So we've been talking. They're still fighting next death in that other world, and... We've got to avenge Papa. Yes, and what's more... Galith, he... He's one of us. Barts? We knew you'd get it. Let's go then, to the other world. But how do we do that? The meteorites don't have enough power to warp anymore. Well, when I think meteorites, I think Sid. He'll probably know something. Okay, and we will do that in the next one. See you guys later. I'm playing a game. <laughs>